Hey guys, what is going on? Nick here with GearNut. And I was cruising around in Walmart the other day, and it was like, actually, I don't know, it was like two months ago. And I was looking for another sleeping bag to go in one of my compact survival kits. You know, and it's springtime right now. It's going to be summer. I wanted it to be a little bit of a warmer weather sleeping bag that I could use with my hammock system or just sleep in the car if I ever had to. And I seen this. This is an Ozark Trail basically Walmart brand, 40 degree cool weather sleeping bag. It's 75 inches long by 33 inches wide. It's, I don't know, it's, it's, it's not the most comfortable sleeping bag I've ever slept in. I've took a couple naps with it. I've took and slept in it a couple nights. And I don't think that I could do 40 degrees in this sleeping bag. I don't think it's gonna be warm enough for me, but everybody's different, so maybe it would work for you. If I was going to do 40 degrees with this sleeping bag, I would probably have to have a liner or something else to help supplement some more heat for me. But I feel for my hammock trips that I'm going to be going on and sleeping in the car this summer and stuff like that, this is going to be a perfect, compact little sleeping bag system. So it's not going to be the most soft sleeping bag. It's not going to give you a lot of cushion. But in my hammock, I don't need a lot of cushion. I just need a little bit of warmth sometimes. So that's the reason I picked this up. If you guys haven't checked these out, they are about 39 bucks, 40 bucks at Walmart. You know, you might be able to get them cheaper online. I'm not too sure about that. But the, the size of this thing is crazy. It, it blew me away. I was like, is that a pillow? Is, that, is this a camp pillow? No, it's a sleeping bag. So it's pretty sweet. Um, here's a framing square. So we're sitting about nine and a half inches. Let me get you guys a better angle for this, huh? So we're sitting about nine and a half inches right there. Not sure about the lighting. And probably about six inches wide. So nine and a half inches long by six inches wide. Plus, you still got some other compact squeeze room. <laughs> you know, I don't think I got this thing cinched down. But it has its own little cinching buckle and cinching straps on here. You know, and it's got its own bag, comes out of the bag. It's just pretty cool. It's got a nice smooth feel to it. Not really sure about all the, the text and the specs on this thing. So, but check them out. You know, I'm, I'm really impressed with this thing. And I will be doing some more extensive tests with this this summer. I got a bug out trip planned with my buddy Kevin and a couple other guys. Maybe we'll uh, take the GoPro and shoot some videos for you. If you guys are interested in that, just let me know and see some of that. But that's what I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any questions or comments, I'll try to answer what I can. But I am really impressed with this sleeping bag so far. So, uh, yeah, if you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you guys don't, give me a thumbs down. Yeah, be that guy. <laughs> but anyhow, I'm always interested in testing out new gear. And I think for 40 bucks, it's worth a shot. Maybe a shot in the dark, but we'll find out if we like it. So that's what I got. I will see you guys later.